Hello everyone, this is Aditya back again with another video. In the last video, we have already discussed about how to implement uh, use camera in our React Native Expo project. Um, there, we have already added camera and uh, we have also um, added uh, how to save our picture, uh, picture to the internal stories. Um, I will provide the link. If you haven't watched that, I will provide the link here. Can visit that uh, you can see was that video from there and in this video we are going to add uh, in this video we are going to understand how to add flash and uh, white balance and we were going to discuss about zoom how to add zoom features as well to our camera so I have already done this I'm gonna explain on each of the code which I have done so let's get started so first of all here I have a, um, I have a um, for white balance uh, um, white balance I have all these features you can get uh, get all the features they have already provided in the docs these are autos and sunny these are all the features that are available so for that after that uh, here I have implemented a uh, user reducer hooks. So, if you don't know about user reducer hook, I will suggest you to go through this first and after that, try to understand it from official uh, official talk. Or you can find plenty of videos uh, on YouTube as well. So, after that, um, here I have in well, it's not that hard to understand user reducer i can explain uh, i'm going to explain it i hope you will understand it very easily and um, this is uh, uh, well user reducer takes uh, reducer as a function and uh, initial state which is uh, which uh, this this one i have initialized here so and uh, this gi gives us two functions uh, one is state and second is dispatch it works the same way as we used to work in uh, red, uh, redux reducer it's almost the same if you understand this from there it's quite easy for you yeah so to implement white balance well when you go to the docs and see let's go on the docs and from there you will get a better idea Okay, so here we got, got let's see white balance first and after that we will move to power. So in white balance, these are the um, all the available features we have, auto sine cloudy and uh, these are uh, these are all I have here as well. So after this and this is how I implemented it. Um, if you are going to watch the previous video and then you will find a lot of difference that's because i have gone offline and um, added a lot of features over here so yeah so here i have mapped through all the here here uh, all the white balance properties and mapped here and here it is after when when the user clicks on, uh, on press on any of them it passes the web um, id which is provided in this array and this uh, this i this here these functions let's go to let's see these functions here here if uh, i am just taking if the length is greater than zero so definitely it should have have to be greater than zero Zero. So here I am going to dispatch this type WH balance type and and I will send the pair this value by payload and after implementing this we are going here here we are getting the state displaying all, getting all the states and after that we are changing the value of this state this action is coming from the payload. Uh, here and this accent dot payload we, we are getting that uh, value here and this value gets sets and the, this which balance state is here 
it's implemented here uh, so in the camera uh, we are passing the uh, white balance through prop property and uh, so this is how the fla uh, white balance feature work here and uh, after that uh, let's see how the flash function is working it's pretty much mm, same here as well there's no not much difference and let's just remove this one here okay, i'm checking if the flash value is off then i'm dispatching the on payload with the same type and uh, yeah, else if the on, if the flash is not off then i'm passing and off payload with the same with the same type and uh, this get executed here it, this sets the flash type from here and after that uh, i have implemented this toggle flash functions here which you can see this one and this enables or disable the flash it's working quite great and uh, after moving forward uh, let me show you the it is available okay uh, i think uh, here it is i'm using the um, um, icons as well so that when it is on there it says it shows different icon and uh, let it this shows zap off and toggle flash and uh, uh, after implementing the uh, flash function now we move forward and uh, let's see how we are going to uh, we are adding our zoom features as well. So, well, to implement zoom zoom functions, I have here I have implemented this feature. This enables you to zoom and to change value. Uh, for this, I have added a third-party package. Third-party package, which is uh, see here it is. So um, react native community slider. You can get that uh, from using expo install react native slider, and you can go through their docs as well, where they they explain everything. And uh, here, here I'm getting this this zoom value state. Uh, here the slider is implemented here on value change this gives you some value i have i'm using this function zoom effect and uh, let's go to this function here you can see i'm getting a value which is a number and uh, i'm passing this value as a payload that uh, type zoom and uh, this goes here here I get the payload and it changes the value of uh, this state and uh, this state is going, getting this, uh, passed to our camera property and this is how it's working so let me show you let's see this was pretty great and uh, one thing you have to take care of is that uh, you should always uh, you should you have to always provide the min minimum value as zero and max value as one because uh, as uh, the doc says um, we can't uh, zoom more than one i guess let's see once here we, uh, a value from zero to one being percentage of size max zoom zero not one minus maximum zoom default is zero so you have to make sure that you don't go below than this one i guess um, it's a float number okay uh, I, I i just named it number here the number type it's fine it doesn't matter yeah that much so this is how it's working even i will provide you the link a github link where you can create all these codes and uh, 
and this is it for this video in the next video we will move forward and try to implement uh, uh, all these features like uh, like implemented uh, implement how to grab this um, how to grab this uh, gallery and relate some other features like focus and auto focus this kind of thing and face detection as well but for now this is it for this video i hope you enjoyed the video and if you like it consider subscribing thank you for watching